Hello everyone. Today I am going to discuss about the application of a correlation in different fields. Let us know what is correlation. The degree of a relationship between the variable under a consideration is measured through the correlation analysis. The measure of a correlation called the correlation coefficient. Correlation between characters x and y is given by R x y. The value for correlation coefficient is ranges from always minus 1 to plus 1. Now have a look on applications of a correlation in agriculture, genetics, physiology, medicine, etc. Correlation is used as a tool. First one, agriculture. Correlation is widely used as a tool of analysis in agricultural science. For example, to estimate the role of a various variables like a fertilizers, irrigation, fertility, soil, etc. on a crop field. Here we also use the regression and a correlation analysis relationship between germination time and temperature of soil, alkalinity of a river water and a growth of a fungi etc can be estimated. Here we also find a correlation between certain weather conditions and productivity and between irrigating and productivity, correlation between price and production or a price and demand to study a demand supply pattern of a crops in a different seasons. Correlation analysis finds a lot of application in genetics. For instance, when R equal to zero, then it indicates that the concerned genes are located at a distance on the same chromosomes. And when R equal to 1, it indicates that the genes are linked. Thus, correlation analysis is very important in gene mapping. From this application, we came to know that how the coefficient of a correlation can be applied to genetics by calculating the gene mapping of a chromosomes through a correlation analysis applied to government sector and the education model how means it is used in a year on year revenue and expenditure correlation to forecast revenue based on expenditure and the tools in a formulating various economic policies by correlating past trends in education models forecasting of a student's input flows towards elementary education correlation between birth rate data and enrollment in elementary grades from this application we concluded that the correlation can be used to calculate the year revenue and expenditure the various economic policies by correlating past trends and the students input like a birth rate data and enrollment in elementary grades thank you